seven. Six. Uh, what's up, everyone? Welcome to Multitap, where nothing has changed <laughs> and it's all the same. And it'll always be the same here on Multitap. We're going to play some Miitopia demo because we love uh, Miitopia. So let's crank that up. <gasps> oh, thanks, Cloak Base. Appreciate that. It's, uh, you know, it's how we feel about jazz summed up. <laughs> Uh, it's only going to be brightly lit for a bit, Ricky. You know how the sun comes and goes. It's all the same. Nothing changed. Nothing changed. It's only going to be this, uh, this lit for a little bit. And then we're going to have to turn on the lights. So, you know, you know how it is. Is audio better this time? I know last time it didn't really work. Oh, GB7 Zone 7. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate that. Welcome to the world of Metopia. Oh, Dark Lord Treasure Troll, <laughs> our biggest foe. But yeah, we were thinking after we finish this up, we would do some Mighty Switch uh, burst. I always, I keep wanting to call it. Oh wait, no, it's Mighty Gunvolt burst. I keep throwing in the switch part. That's the mistake I make. Uh. Wow, Cloak Base, that's kind of a rude way to put it. I don't even know if I need to answer that. Alright, which way should we go, right or left? Oh, what's up, Multitap Dave? Good to see ya. Hey, Dave. Should we go left or right, guys? Which way do you think? I'm, I see treasure, and I want to go towards that treasure, so I don't know. And it's okay, we'll be able to go the other way. So All right, Fooey says go left. All right, Fooey. <laughs> Fooey's smart. He's played this before, so no, I, no. I'm i going to take his word for it. We'll be going the other way soon enough. Treasure can wait. But is the audio better this time? Can you guys hear the game okay? I know it was a little uh, wonky last time, so hopefully it's better. If not, let me know, and I'll uh, tweak it. All right, great. Wonderful. Hmm. He was a good partner. Uh, we hope he does show up, Cloak Face. Alright, Jazz is doing a cool quirk. He is acting cool, as Jazz does. Which cool and laid back. <laughs> Just makes a pose and does more damage, I guess. That's what cool people do. Stubborn. That's me. <laughs> good to be stubborn when someone's hurting you. And there's Mario Oran, our biggest fan. <laughs> I'm with the stick. Uh -oh. oh, first assist. <laughs> ah. Aw. Uh -huh. Tried to tell him to look, but didn't help. Mario Oran wasn't paying attention, unfortunately. Tar is the sage, I guess, but I don't think he's actually a party member. He's yeah. just, uh... He's an NPC, I guess. He is the Great Sage, who faces off against the Treehouse Troll. Um, I get the feeling we probably won't be seeing Tar again. That was his big moment. Yeah, there you go. Thanks, Fooey. Oh, level ups for everyone. Yay, I got a level, and I learned Earworm. Get enemies dancing to a catchy tune. Oh, boy. <laughs> what a waste. What about Mario Aran? Nothing. Nothing? Jazz? Oh, what's up, Freem? Oh, there we go. Jazz can finally cook. Thank goodness. Yeah, that works, Dave. <laughs> that works. <laughs> ah, shoot. Oh, bonus EXP. It's such a tiny amount that it doesn't really matter. But we'll give it to Jazz since he needs to catch up. Yeah. Help Jazz out. <laughs> know any good tunes, Moog? Uh, we are treehouse trolls. Uh, we wobble to and fro. Can you tie us in a knot? Can you tie us in a bow? It, it goes something like that. <laughs> Great weather for adventuring indeed. Can I release Mario or Ran like a Pokemon? Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Oh, what's up, Garbage King? How are you? 
Like, all right, so I will say this game, it, it pretty much lets you switch out people whenever you want. So if we really want to change someone, we can, but I think for the sake of this, it's best to just leave everyone how they are. Unless, like, someone really wants to be in the party. Who wants to join the party? <laughs> Woo! It's a party! <laughs> Yeah, see, Fooey, that doesn't seem very realistic. Some of these relationships, you know, not the same as real life. But it's all a game. <laughs> it's Dragon Quest with your best friends? Besties! <laughs> G-O-T-Y? Anyone? Maybe! Well, your tune worked on all of them except that guy. He didn't like it. Oh, wow, we. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> oh, fighting clouds. Oh, is this a Final Fantasy ref? Questies with your besties. <laughs> Nothing better than that. Remember the uh, uh, is Seth Green, Doctor Evil's son, in the Dragon Quest Nine ads. Yeah. Is that his name, Seth Green? Yeah, yeah I think so. Do you remember those commercials, guys? <laughs> Anybody? Anyone? Dragon Quest Nine? Seth Green? Hello? Oh, I need to move this over here. Hold up. All right. One thing that's really cool about Neatopia that some of the other games I think didn't do, like in Tomodachi Life, you couldn't uh, get your friends' me's from your friends list. This one lets you get me's from your friend list. It lets you make me's on the spot, which. Uh, as you know, on the Switch now, you can like make your meats different hair colors and stuff, so it lets you do that. Oh, that's cool. So, it's a lot better at letting you put in the meats that you want than previous me games, which I guess really all there was was Tomodachi Life and Mitomo. Maybe there was some other stuff. Mitomo. <laughs> Uh, open it, leave it. I mean, <laughs> I chose a failing comedian. Who will you choose? <laughs> Is that Seth Green or Seth McFarlane that you're thinking of, Cloak Base? I guess maybe it. Actually, I guess it probably doesn't apply to the latter. Came all this way, gonna open it. Unfortunately. Oh, you got three game tickets. Yay! We got tickets! Ooh, found an inn! Nothing this way but an end. Seth Green has a brilliant career as a Mass Effect character now. All right. Well, that's good. Oh, shoot. Oh. Looks like there's a new party. Oh, for All right. wait, who's this going to be? So this is going to be your last party member. Guys, who's the last party member going to be? Dragmire? Uh, all right. So Dragmire says Dragmire. It's Dragmire. It's got to be drag. There he is. Uh, he has a different name in Meetopia Land. <laughs> oh, whoa, let's fix that real quick. Whoa, whoa, Drag me. whoa, whoa. All right, so what kind of- I give this stream a thumbs up now. Oh, uh, <laughs> if I hadn't already taken stubborn, I think stubborn <laughs> would have fit quite well. Well, you can have two stubborn. But let's go with kind. I believe kind. Dragmire is a kind Dragmire. individual. Dragmire is a kind person. All right. And what kind of class? Uh, Dragmire. Let's see. Uh, we let's. Um, what do thieves do? Do we have a thief? No. You have a chef. Let's do thief. All right. I mean, <laughs> you're always stealing my good ideas, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh. All right, so hopefully we'll get to change some things soon because but for steel world records. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Finally made it. Sorry, I'm late. He's a kind thief like Lupin. He loves Lupin, so it makes sense, right? Yeah, and he always does his best. It's a Lupin homage. Okay, so all right, so where should Dra should Dragmire bunk with? Jazz? Yeah, bunk with Jazz. All right. Bunk buddies. They're best buds. All right. Before I do anything else, I need to change a few things here. Uh, I'll admit I did change some people from the last stream. 
and one of them was the Nintendo fan. As you can see, I made Dragmar the Nintendo fan because I figured he was the biggest one, <laughs> but now he's gonna have to be someone else, so. Uh, oh well. You know what? We'll make the Nintendo fan Kodo because I haven't. Or actually, I forgot oh, if I put. Too any. bright. Maybe that's too bright. I'll, I'll just make it Kodo because I didn't put Kodo in anywhere. So Kodo's now the Nintendo fan instead of Dragmire. Could you turn that one on too? What? The light? Mm hmm. Oh, it's on. Wow. Uh, I didn't even know. Alright. So that's fixed, but we have to change some things about Dragmire also. Show me all your amiibos. Uh, yeah. Maybe later. Yeah, right. I mean, yeah. If we need more game tickets or whatever, we'll, we'll go to you, Kodo. But, um, so let's see. We need to give Dragmire a, a war cry. Did he already suggest one or? All right. I'm going to go with, hey, Jude. But if you guys have something better, let me know. I mean, like, all caps, the way he would say it. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Loud. I think that's pretty good. Oh, ooh, the angry one. All right, perfect. <laughs> all right, so Dragmire is all set now. Warcry, curse word yelled at high volume into the mic. Isn't that someone else cloak face? I mean, it, I guess, no, you're right, it's him, but. All right, so you have quite a bit of gold, so I think everyone will be able to buy everything they want. We'll start with Jazz. Jazz wants a non-stick frying pan. Always a good investment. Treat yourself. All right, and he bought it. So he can put it on right away. See, Dragmire wants some leather gear. Okay. Ooh. Why not? Okay. And he got it. Good. So far, all of your uh, people have been buying stuff. Just as they should. Uh, sure. Looking good, uh, cowboy. You guys want bananas, so you get your bananas. Hmm. Good friend, Mario Aran. There we go. Alright, now you gotta share the food. None of you have eaten the cotton candy. Who deserves cotton candy? Oh, jazz. Alright. He hates it. Oh, <laughs> uh, oops. Alright, now, uh, Dragmire? Yeah, Dragmire, maybe he'll like it. Alright, he likes cotton candy. He likes it, he likes it. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's just the next level of cotton candy? Uh, try that on Jazz. He still doesn't. Oh! <laughs> you never know, Jazz. He might. He might. Try it on Dragmire again. I'm gonna starve you and Mario. Uh, Alright, you like this. Don't know how Dragmire feels about it yet. He yeah, likes. it's pretty bad, Mungo, but... It's, uh, it's wireless, is what I will say. So... It's, this is about as, uh, good as you're gonna get. Oh wait, there is, uh, there is priority, that's true. Let's try, next time that happens, I'll see if I can, uh, change the priority in the middle of this. I don't know if it will let me, but yeah, top screen has the priority, so. But it's, it's a little low bandwidth, so you know. Oh, what's up, Scott? How are you hey, doing? Alright. So, uh, I don't know if it'll let me change in the middle though, but we'll see. Who deserves a vacation? Uh... Oh, we have to restart? Uh, never mind then. We'll just, we'll soldier on. We're almost done with the demo, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, so... Let's give him to Dragmire, because he loves tickets. Don't worry, Dragmire will bring along his best friend, Jazz. <laughs> Uh, is that good, Scott? That sounds a little sketchy. And yeah, I'm, I'm sorry that it's choppy, guys, but this is, uh, the best we can do. 
I hope it's still watchable, uh, despite being choppy. Alright, enough of that nonsense. What, Nintendo's banning 3DS's? No. That was the first I've heard of it. <laughs> see, I could try it now and see if that works. Yeah, it looks like you had to restart to make that take an <clears throat> to take effect. You got to restart it. So, uh, meet the bottom choppy screen, everybody. <laughs> it's gonna be choppy for the rest of this demo. Well, no, it's it's more important for the top screen to be uh, priority. Oh, who's this? Just imagine the bottom screen is the old 3DS, and the top screen is the new 3DS. Oh no, it's a Rocky Fooey. Oh, what's up, Rocky Fooey? <laughs> <laughs> we gotta save him. <laughs> Why are you feeling Rocky Fooey? <laughs> Yo, Adrian, I did it. I missed him getting this, home cooking. Is it different from regular cooking? <laughs> Fooey rocks. He sure does. <laughs> Why does Fooey look like Hank Hill here? He has some of the same features as the popular Hank Hill me. Yes, that is true. But that doesn't mean those are Hank Hill's features alone. Me's can share features. <laughs> Sharing is caring, Scott. Don't you know that? We wouldn't want that cloak face. Alright, Dragmire. Oh, you know, Dragmire's just starting out, so he doesn't do too much damage, but at least he's not dead yet. Got kind of a hey, weird party. Hey, I'd share with you, Scott. Yes, yeah, it's good at keeping everyone healthy from Rocky Pooey's assault. Scott, you could be in my uh, RPG party any day. <laughs> no questions asked. Just not today. Party's too full. Wait for the full version. <laughs> Impact. Alright. It looks like you guys are doing okay. I don't think Fooey's gonna be able to kill you. Unless, like, there's critical hits in this game. Yeah, unfortunately, the, uh... <coughs> The gamble command is different, and they don't uh, have a way to alias it. Which is weird, because you can alias other things in stream elements, but not the uh, gambling module. So it's roulette now. <laughs> oh, what's up, Went? Good to see ya. How are you? Welcome to Metopia. <laughs> it's a fiesta here. <laughs> Alright, killed everything except Fui. He keeps hurting everyone real bad, but since we have cooks and, uh, I don't know, actually, I think Mario's a cleric, right? So you guys are managing to stay healthy, except Jazz just ate a banana, because I guess he's out of magic. You know what? Maybe I should heal some people. Uh, you guys can take on Fooey, right? Sure! No need for Sprinkle. Sure we can! Ooh, Jazz totally deflected that attack, and you killed Fooey. Alright, great. See? Beat Fooey without any sprinkles. <laughs> what a waste of time. <laughs> winner, winner, chicken dinner. Thank you, Fooey. Okay. And I think whoever gets the last hit, it calls them their team, so it's that, that Team Jazz one. But, you know. Go Team Jazz! Another level for Jazz. Dragmeyer gets his first level. Ooh, that's a lot of EXP. That can help Dragmire catch up a bit. I think you can just add random me's as your friends, Scott, so you don't really need friends. You can, you can make up friends. Yeah, but yeah, you can add them from the friend list, too. Oh. <laughs> There's nothing better than friends created from scratch. <laughs> nothing better. You, you like have my old uh, me on here from my uh, last 3DS account, and it's like, it looks strangely off-model from the new one. <laughs> you can make up friends! Alright, so Mario wants a squeaky staff. We have plenty of money still, so why not? 
got it. Put on your hammer. Let those drag mire want outdoor gear. You just bought <laughs> it works too when you run out of friends in real life. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Alright. Uh there we go. Drag mire colors. Surely they wouldn't work against us, Cloak Base. No. No. <laughs> Mario or in. Go go down there and scout it out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if you want to switch up the uh Sleeping arrangements, just say so. Otherwise, I'm just gonna leave them how they are. Alright, yeah, so you guys ate all of your bananas from that last time, so you have a couple more at least. Hey, what is this? Chocolate rock? Give it to Jazz, because I don't know if Jazz has anything he's like yet. There we go. Jazz loves it. Fine candy, give it to Mario. Mario hasn't eaten anything for a while. Hates it. That was a waste. Stream elements as emoticons move over, Revlo. Yeah. Oh, we we miss you, Revlo. But you're okay, stream elements. You're all right. All right. You are exercising with Mario. Oh man, I'm feeling the burn. Wow. This is uh <laughs> um. <laughs> Shout out to Revlo, we know you up there! <laughs> we miss you, Revlo! You guys are better buds. Bo, we, we like you too, Stream Elements. We like you too. <laughs> Did you know if you put the stream on 160p, you can't read anything? Oh, that sucks. That actually does kind of bum me out, Scott, but... What, what can be said? You, can you still see us in 160p? Can you still hear us? Some of the people in town. Dark Lord guy who showed up out of nowhere. T Troll, was it? T Troll! What hole did he crawl out from? Mmm. No skin off my nose. He doesn't care. Oh, Rockania still doesn't have. No face. Face. Where could it be? All the way over there. <laughs> we'll get there eventually. Uh, sassy child. <laughs> <laughs> Any Snurgle Gurglers? Uh, not that we've seen yet. And the Sassy Child's Worried Mother Dave. <laughs> worried Mother Dave? Dave! Dave! What's up, Dave? Oh, look, and Hank and Peggy with- Why does Peggy have no fi- Oh, right, <laughs> this is the curse or whatever. Mama Dave! So I guess we're still missing two faces. Oh, there's Peggy's face. We could go save Peggy's face. Oh, frit. Oh, wait. This is who we just save. Alright, so, got Pooey's face back. Ooh, I don't know. <laughs> he he might have looked better without it. <gasps> <laughs> this is the King of the Hill fanfiction I was waiting for. <laughs> got my face back. Oh. Mixed up with a bad one. Not as bad, sort of, I suppose. What will Fooey give us? <laughs> Ten gold. Thanks, Fooey. It looks great, Scott! That looks... Mm, mwah, perfect. What's up, System Defect? How are you? Dubious mere odd job. Everyone <laughs> used to be so peaceful. I must inform the king at once. Do you summon them with phrases like, Can anyone fix Dream Element? <laughs> Oh, it's broken! Hmm. Where, oh, where is my support? Can someone just tweet at Stream Elements for me and say, It's broken. Come fix it. Fix it, please. Oh, getting blisters. Uh-oh. Something here. Alright. Should Dragmire look in the bushes? Yes! <laughs> look! Be brave, Dragmire! It's a kitten! Aw, oh, he's more of a dog person. <laughs> Here, kitty kitty. Aw. Yeah, that's just kind of how it is, Squishy, unfortunately. It's the best we can do. It's wireless streaming. You can change the priority, but you gotta reboot the whole thing. So, I hope you like a choppy bottom screen, because uh, here it is. Up or down? Oh, down will do. 
Sometimes you gotta go down. Hey! That's why you're on my team, Dragmar. We think alike. <laughs> Alright. I, I don't see any reason not to open treasure chests. Oh, what's up, Kamish? Good to see ya. You're always gonna get something. Good to see ya. Hey, Kamish. Oh, Frame! With the shout out. I could not hear that alert. That could be a problem later. But if anyone else redeemed anything, I apologize. Okay. Shout out from Frame. Shout out to Stream Elements. I see your import from Revlo option. Mighty nice. Thanks, Freem. Oh, it didn't even play. Uh, well, that's good. That's good. Uh, so you, if you type exclamation point, uh, store, squishy, you'll get a link to the new store, and then you can redeem stuff. Just like you always have. <laughs> squishy, don't do this. Don't do this, Squishy. I got the data. <laughs> I got the data. Don't do this. Alright. Again, up or down. Oh, I haven't played Darkest Dungeon. Is that any good? You know what? You already went down. Go up. Why not go up? Is that a PC game? Oh, sorry, Foo. Garbage King? Can you still gamble? Uh, so the gamble, yeah, as you just saw, gamble command has changed to a uh, roulette. And so there you go. There you go. But it's the same, more or less. I hope you brought some to share, Jas. See, it works great. <laughs> What'd you bring to share? They are all hungry and Jazz start eating, or at least it looked that way. But Jazz is just pretending to eat. I'm trying to trick my stomach into feeling full. This journey's taking a real mental toll on Jazz. Let's hope he'll last until we can get some grub at the next end. Why don't you cook something, Jazz? I mean, I think as far as a uh, <clears throat> solution we could switch to quickly, Stream Elements is pretty good. And I'm sure it will only get better. Here, here. Oh, they're asleep. Continue playing. That's it for now. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're going to beat this demo. <laughs> I think. Oh, what's up, Space Kiss? How are you? Oh, shoot. I should have been more careful because you were finally running out of money. Oh, well. At least you got a new Shh. outfit. Don't tell them, Freem. <laughs> Jeez, Freem. All right. Oh, Shh. you know when it's move, you gotta have yellow. Shh. No. All right, so we are finally out of money. We'll we'll try and get a little more money with good old rock scissors paper. What what are you feeling this time? Uh, paper. All right. <laughs> All right. Oh, paper. All right. Okay. All right. Stop there. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I don't think I can push it like last time. It's it's better to get something than nothing. That's very true. No, I don't feel lucky <laughs> tonight. I feel very unlucky. <laughs> nope. No. Nope. Not gonna trick me. Slow and steady wins the race. <laughs> That's not to gamble too much. I know what we're suffering for cash. We need that money. All right. Yeah, with this, hopefully we'll be able to buy whatever Mario wants, which is frilly vestments. Here you go. And he got it. Good children, as always. All right. Well, unfortunately, old Mario isn't here to say what color he wants. What do you think he should wear? Uh, let's go with purple. Good old purple. I heard you guys were the arms champs of the world. Is that true? Well, Dave, <laughs> there's a lot of factors that could go into determining that, but I'm going to go with yes. Yes, we are. Thanks for asking. Uh, any other great questions? Yeah, Revlo's gone, Kamish. Rest in peace. But uh, hello, Stream Elements. How are you? Hello. Uh... 
Uh, it's like nothing changed. I don't think. Well, maybe there was something Dragmire hated. Seems like he's eating everything, though. Oh, set out. <laughs> Bye, children. For your birthday, can I bring Revlo back? Uh, something tells me it wouldn't be cheap to bring Revlo back because, as far as I know, they did have uh, some investors or some venture capitalists uh, backing them. So, I don't know if the problem was that they had no money, it's just they had no uh, plans to generate money in the future, or no, you know, solid plans. Hey, I'm sorry, bottom screen's the way it is. Come on, guys, it's not that bad, is it? Is it that bad? Yes, you have, welcome back, Mario Oran. Do you know what? Everybody in the chat uh, doubted you would uh, come back, and here you are. Hmm. So you showed them. Hey, Mario. But yeah, you've been a big help, so thank you. Getting us through this game. Getting us through the tough spots. Now we've got a safe spot. It's good enough, guys. Come on. Come on. All right, so Mario is laughing uncontrollably right now at all his haters. So we're gonna put him in the safe spot so we can heal while everyone else keeps on fighting. Do you like the new outfit we gave you, uh, Mario? Higher defense. Alright, so hopefully you guys can manage without Mario's help right now until Mario goes back to not laughing. Cool. Yeah, it's, it's not bad. It's what your character asked for, so we bought it right away. Alright, so we stopped laughing so we can move him out of the safe spot and back into the fight. Puggy Hill. Uh, commish type exclamation point and then store. And that's a quick way to get to the store from the chat. Oh, or, or wait for Dave to post it. Even better. Thanks, Dave. Dig in. Delicious. Yeah, healing his friends. And Mario also good. Dragmire and Chris are the attackers of this group. Uh, all right, he's being kind to the monsters for some reason. Don't want to do that right now, Dragmire. Did you do any? Ooh, I don't think he used any of his perks yet. Jazz and I did some stuff, but I don't think this uh, go around he has yet. Oh wait, oh, you never know. I mean, do you count this? I guess this is just general healing, but still useful. <laughs> still useful. Ooh, got, got the bananas. We love those bananas. You at least haven't been doing any hurtful perks like Dragmire has. I guess it's not Chris is looking elsewhere. Hey, pay attention. <laughs> Why doesn't this guy pay attention? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I don't think so, Mario. Not yet, anyways. I'll help. But, I mean, you've been super helpful, so... Good enough. And, yeah, you guys took down the Peggy Hill Mouse easily. Daughter. So cool. Farewell. Team Dragmire. Whoa, hold up. <laughs> Since when is it Team Dragmire? I mean, worried for a moment there. Yeah, it just changes depending on who gets the last hit. Alright, extra EXP. Well, it is Team Dragmire, so now nah, we'll give it to you since you're so close to another level. Alright. Level 4. Seems kind of greedy. Oh yeah, you're right. I'm a Mire Tap. <laughs> That's me. Okay. Fortunately, that ends right after you beat a boss. Nice, so. Mario. All we have to do is get one more face and we'll be good. see wow everyone wants something and we definitely we probably can't even afford any of these things. <laughs> bunch of greedy greedy guesses right, definitely can't get the chick gear that dragmire wants. do we even have tickets yeah i think you still have at least one or two tickets all right yeah i can't afford anything so yeah you have two tickets so you can either do the roulette or you can do let's do roulette all right nothing to it but to do it
A generous helping of EXP? Hey, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's great. But dang, we need to get some money somehow. Alright, so who should get? Uh, Jazz. Alright. Old Jazz is gonna get it. Look at Jazz go. Ooh, he learned flambe. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. All right, so do you want to try and get money or? Uh, yes. All right. Is that only through rock, scissors, paper? Yes, like you can. Oh boy. All right, guys. All right, you know what? No, I'm letting the chat pick <laughs> because then at least I can blame somebody if this goes south. Rock, scissors, or paper, guys. Rock, scissors, or paper. Whatever I see more of, that's what I'm going for. I see Rock from Space Kiss. Uh, I think we'll have to go with Rock then. Bio Duck is not a choice. All right, rock, it's Rock. Lose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't win them all. Can't win them all. Better luck next time. All right, so. <laughs> Good old Rock. That's all our tickets. Of course, we could get more tickets if we used our amiibos, but uh, I, think, <laughs> I think we're okay for now. We don't need, Dwayne Johnson. We don't need all that fancy new gear. All right, who should get the cheese? The special cheese? Uh, Dragmar, because he's the most like a rat. <laughs> well, see, he, well, uh, never mind. Well, I don't know. I don't know if he liked it or not. <laughs> all right, so have to set out because we don't have no money. That's okay. Maybe we'll get a nice <laughs> reward from Peggy. Oh, what's up, uh, G-Man Plays Games? How are you? <laughs> that character was too charming. Back to Peggy. Peggy Hill. <laughs> I don't know, I tried to disable the rank stuff, Kamish, because I don't think we should rank each other on multi-tap. <laughs> so if you see rank somewhere, uh, ignore it. What rank? Look, it's back. It's all thanks to this adventure. <laughs> oh, all right. Oh man, we can play more rock, scissors, paper. Hype. We're gonna be so rich, guys. <laughs> so rich. <laughs> all right, let's see. You're better than 30th? Is that your rank? I don't understand what rank is, so don't ask me. Whatever it is, I'm sure it's not worth worrying about. So, I guess there is one more rule. I wonder if I, we can change it right now. Oh, is it just a rank of your current jiggies versus everybody else? Is that what it is? Because, uh... Revlo kind of had that with the leaderboard, but... I don't think anyone ever looked at it. Ah. Oh, it's juiced. All right, so this is pretty much the last role we're able to assign in this game. So who should be the soldier? All right, who do we want to be a soldier, guys? Who's it gonna be? Wait, I'm confused. Basically, that's going to be the last person we see before the demo ends, so... Mungo? I don't have a me for Mungo. Well, we'll, we'll see who we have available. It's Dragmire, right? We already <laughs> put him in there. Alright, so let's see. We need someone better than Juiced. We could put Kodo in there. Uh, Alright. I mean, she's already the Nintendo fan. Oh, never mind. I missed that. I don't, uh, know, I don't know if I made Alan. All right, put Alan in there. Alan will be the guard. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I did make Alan someone. Oh, well. Good. Not elf. Uh, do I have an elf me? Uh, no. <laughs> I don't have an elf me. Sorry. That would be good. But no elf. Oh man, did you make it on Wii, Mungo? Is, is it a Goemon character? Be honest. <laughs> All 
Onward. Wait, yeah, to it being on Wii or being a Goemon character. Uh oh. Uh, okay, Mario. <laughs> Let her rip. <laughs> I'm scared, but uh, <laughs> let her rip. Oh, I guess I should. Well, Drakmeyer is still fighting, even though he's crying. Oh, I can't watch videos uh, while I'm gaming because it breaks my gamer focus. Very true. All right, Jazz is using his new ability. Ball but day. if you post it in the chat, I will bookmark it and watch it later. for some reason. Awesome. Thank you, Mario. Go ahead and bookmark that. Well, that too, frame. Thank you, Mario. Alright, so that time it actually worked out. Dragmire was kind to the enemy, and through his kindness, he made the enemy leave somehow. Alright, there we go. First assist concern. This isn't a personality thing, but it is a special skill, Mario. You and Chris are such good buds. Top buds. Get well soon. Is it a friend in the safe spot to speed up the recovery? Neat. Oh, you got an error for your shout out, Kamish? Uh, did you fill in the the box? Freem got a shout out earlier. It worked for him. You should try again, Kamish. <laughs> Do you like that <laughs> that solution? Uh, try again. No, that was weird. The speech bubble was off camera. Oh, donate. Are you gonna let Freem show you up, Kamish? No. Thanks for the donation, Dragmire. Bring back Revlo. I can't. I can't. Setting up traps like uh, Macaulay Culkin. Team Dragmire wins yet again. Oh, that's good. At least it didn't charge you. Like, the the way you enter it is a little screwy. Freem might be able to help you if he wants to. Yeah, there you go. It, you have to load the thing, press the buy button, then type and press the other button. Yeah, this is simple, really. D did you get all that, Kamish? So, you can go up and get the treasure chest, or you can just go to the right and skip it, because who needs treasure? Uh, go to the right. Oh, what's up, the Scenic? Hey, the Scenic. We don't have time. Good to see ya. We don't have time for treasures. <laughs> Remember to donate bits. To multi tab Eugen to help bring back Revel. That's not how it works. That's not how it works. Who for Ghost Treasure? They told me to skip it last time, Garbage King. I'm just doing what they tell me. Well, I'm. I screwed up, alright? <laughs> I mean, we can always go back for it, but I don't, I don't think we're gonna need it. This group is so good that I think you're gonna be able to beat the final boss. Can I get it in the full version? <laughs> this ruined a perfectly good scam. I'm, I'm sorry, Mungo. Look sorry. At... Oh, what good friends. <gasps> well, hey, Reflo was good to us. It was a good service. I, I completely agree with everyone else. It sucks, and I'm gonna miss it. At least we have stream elements. They're not so bad, and they're only gonna get better. So. Uh, I'm looking forward to see what they bring to the table. It's pretty uh, darn cool for where it is already, so so I'm liking it. Jazz is the cook. Dragmire is the thief. Wow, another level up for old Jazz. Yay, Jazz! And you got some slime jelly, too. Cheer up. Cheer up, Mario. <laughs> Turn that frown upside down. 
There are a lot of monsters in this cave. We offer each other, warning each other of danger, like good buds do. <laughs> yeah, are you calling Jazz a thief, Squishy? It's a little harsh. <laughs> I mean, I only did that to Dragmar because he likes Lupon, so you know, it's a Lupon the third thing. It it kind of does space kiss. It combines, yeah. Like it does a lot of the same things that Streamlabs uh, does, and probably has some other features. So it's cool. I might, they might be taking on a little too much, in my opinion. But it's still, it's still pretty good. It has a leaderboard that shows I have the most jiggies at the moment. It's already better than Revlo. I mean, Revlo had that too, but it was it was hard to get to. <laughs> that should be displayed up front and center. Yes. That was tough. Alright, everyone else caught up with Jazz's level 5. Yay! Learned out of tune. <laughs> That's just how I sing always. <laughs> Mario level up, Dragmire leveled up, Pilfer. Oh, yeah, you know what, you're right, it doesn't show the current, uh, yep, you guys are both right, my mistake. Stream Elements does it again! <laughs> I forgot, you guys are so right. Something on the ground. Banana. <laughs> Don't worry, Dragmire's going to Stream Elements, too. He told me in a private conversation. He said, don't worry, Stream Elements on the way. And I said, thanks, Dragmire. <laughs> Why are you telling me this? <laughs> Why are you talking to me? <laughs> yeah. Achievements. Yay! Oh, boy, we're going to have to go through this for all the different classes. Ugh. <laughs> Leaps level five. Who knew? Chivos. I, actually, I guess we already saw Jazz's act, or it doesn't give it till the end. So never mind. We'll have to go through his too. All right. <laughs> Got those out of the way. Hey, everybody's happy. <laughs> oh, Mario, do you probably like me? <laughs> Good snack. Too. Oh, we learned charity. I guess. Oh, acquainted, new best buds, perhaps? We will watch each other's back. Jazz and Dragmire? <laughs> you guys are so right, Mugen, after being told not to lock Zeke from his room this Tapcon. All right, so who deserves the money most first? <laughs> hey, super friends, all right. We'll try and earn some more money, but uh, deserves it. Who, who wants the most expensive thing? Uh, let's see, so 210, 310, 310, 310. Alright, so uh, everyone Jazz. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, uh, Mario. Alright. Sorry, I'm biased. Because <laughs> me and him are super friends. Alright, he got his wicker vestments. Hey! Oh! Hey, what color do you want it to be, Mario? What color would you like? You got blue, uh, green, yellow, pink, brown, red. Uh, black. You know, all right, blue. Let's go blue. Love that blue. All right, so we'll try and earn some more money since we got some tickets from Peggy. All right, we need help from the chat again. Rock, scissors, or paper? Let's go. Most popular thing wins. <laughs> Rock, scissors, paper. Rock, scissors, paper. Rock, scissors, paper. The Wicker Mario, my favorite Nick Cage film. Rock, paper, ooh, we need a tiebreaker. Paper, all right, go paper. All right, here comes paper. Oh, no! That's, that's okay, we still have two more tickets. Oh, Clippers! I don't think uh, Chuck Norris is an option. If it was, you know I'd go for that, but... What? You were right, Bowie, okay? You just... The majority ruled, and they ruled poorly. All right, so what this time? Paper again? Rock again? All right, let's, let's go again. Guys, let's go again. Well, actually, 
Let's maybe let all right, Rock. Let's test Fooey's. Uh, wow, paper would have been good. <laughs> paper would have been good. All Rock right. always wins, huh? All right, we only have one more ticket left. We're poor, darn it. Yeah, let's play. All right, starting from Freem saying rocket launcher, let's go again. Everyone just say rock, scissors, or paper. Come on. Shout it out. Let's go. Rock, scissors, paper. All right, so Mario says paper, scissors, rock. That's two papers, two rocks. We need a tiebreaker for paper and rock. First thing that gets said that's either paper or rock, I'm going to take it. Even if it's from the same person, I guess. Paper or rock. Uh, whoa. Okay, rock it is. Let's okay. just go rock. <laughs> no! Oh! Baloney! All down Baloney! All down the toilet. Oh, uh, this is garbage. Yeah. No garbage. One, no one's gonna get their equips. That's okay. Oh, wow, who said scissors? <laughs> <laughs> Oh right. man! Slime jelly. Uh, you, you like slime jelly? <laughs> They're on to me. My strategy. Nope. All right. How did they know? Everyone else will get a drink. Tears. <laughs> I'm drinking my tears right now. Mario doesn't like tears. Jazz loves tears. It, uh, you know that makes a lot of sense. Makes a lot of sense. Wouldn't you agree, Squishy? <laughs> that that makes a lot of sense. All right, slime jelly. Mario really likes the slime jelly. We'll give him one just because we know he likes it, but then we'll take a gamble on someone else. Who should get the last food? Uh, Dragmire. You're right. He hasn't had enough yet. Well, oh, jeez! Like He's so picky! <laughs> well, he was liking the other stuff. Alright. You don't like sugar in your salsa? Picky. Picky Dragmire. So picky. So no need to worry about that chest, because who cares? Because who cares? Hopefully you guys are strong enough to take on this last boss. Otherwise, we're going to have to go through some pain, possibly some training. No! But I figure you can... Oh, wait. Did, are we supposed to go back and get that treasure that we skipped? Uh, you could. Um... Mario, don't you think it would be fun to see if we could do it without the uh, treasure? You know, a little bit of challenge? That's what I'm thinking. What an ordeal. I think it might make it, like, more exciting. What? Skipping the goodies. Dude, why'd you have to say that? Uh-oh. Uh... But... Here, here's the thing, Mario. Daniel has control of the game, and he's marching forward. I can't stop him. He's a madman. He can't be stopped. He thinks just because he has a Nintendo Switch hat that no harm can fall upon him. He thinks the hat protects him. Isn't that crazy? It's crazy. Is it really a required to... I, I don't think it is... Dream. I've got a hunch that it's not required. Oh, I can't ever get it? Well, that sucks. Even when the full version comes out, I can't get it? Oh no, it's Rocket Nia. Treasure's meant to be left for the treasure troll. Yeah, that's it. That's what we're doing. Need HP bananas. Mario's gonna try and steal. All right, got the HP banana. <laughs> Look out! Did not heed Jazz's warning. This one goes out to all of you. All right, good. Doesn't affect Rocket Nia or those guys, but got two of the slimes. Oh no, Mario! Mario, heal yourself. Or, or maybe me. I don't know. No, heal yourself, Mario. Alright, looks like Jazz is gonna heal Mario. Oh, good job, Jazz. And Mario will probably heal you. Hey, you guys are becoming friends too. Ooh, acquaintances. They learn show off. <laughs> you and Jazz are buddies. <laughs> Here comes Dragmire. Yes. 
All right, yep, he's killing you. Uh, Chris is me. <laughs> Can't you tell? <laughs> How about that? Look out! He's just not caring about these warnings. Oh, geez. All right, so Rockin' E is hurting a bit, but that's okay, because this party has a lot of healers in it. Uh-oh. Fortunately, they didn't attack Chris. You okay? <laughs> you okay? I'm multi-tap Mugen now. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, Chris refused Mario's healing. What? And he decided to eat a banana instead. What? Because <laughs> you're stubborn. Why am I so stubborn? <laughs> Just born that way, I guess. Alright, Jazz is gonna heal Mario again. He's leaving his friend Dragmire to die, I guess. I guess it's, you know, makes sense. I was too stubborn to take that treasure you were telling me about, and I'm too stubborn to uh, take your heal as well. <laughs> Dragmire stole that banana earlier, so he could eat the banana. Too stubborn for Revlo. Ain't around, Space Kiss. Jazz got rid of one of the slimes. Only one more slime left, then everyone can focus on Rocket Nia. Oh no! Ooh, no! 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 Jazz! But since this is the first time we got someone KO'd, we have one last resort, one last chance to heal someone. Uh, we don't have to revive Jazz with this, because again, we only get one, but I feel like it's probably best to have. A as many party members as you can, right? Uh, yes. So, we're going to use it on Jazz. If anyone else falls, sorry. Save him! Save him! We saved you, Jazz! You know If what? you don't have to, don't do it. What the heck, Squishy? What the heck? Just, just use sprinkles all over the place. Everyone gets sprinkles. Baby powder for everybody! Oh boy, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh well. Sprinkle some sprinkles on them. <laughs> get out of there. <laughs> Encore! Oh, you guys got Rocket Nia now. Don't worry, Jazz, we fixed you up. Alright, no more slimes to worry about, just gotta get rid of Rocket Well, you wasted the sprinkles! <laughs> <laughs> Don't we still have HP sprinkles, Mario. Don't worry, we have a few sprinkles left. Just a smidge, and, uh, you know, I think we'll be okay. Did we? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can't beat this game without Jazz. <laughs> you can't beat it without Jazz. As in smashing Rockin' E with the frying pan. You gotta have uh, the J-Man on your team. Ooh, Mario took a big step there. Oh no, I hope. Oh, Alright, good. Alright, we're good. Heal, good heal. Good heal, Mario. Right, eat that nanner. Got bananas to eat. Got oh. Uh, <laughs> see you later, Breen. Uh... <laughs> Talk to you later. Uh, all right. Like that. It's a cure. Mario heals himself. Dragmire ran out of bananas, so he stole another one. Eat the nanners. Jazz is hurt really bad. I hope someone heals Jazz. I mean, I guess I could use some of those sprinkles again. You know what? Oh, wait. Who's Jazz gonna heal? Mario? Dig in. Uh, Jazz will be fine. Mmm, delicious. Let's see, Mario healed Jazz. It all works out. No need to panic and use sprinkles. Guys, this isn't the time right now. <laughs> Save those sprinkles for your uh, Dunkaroos. <laughs> well, wait, no, Dunkaroos. I guess the sprinkles were in the frosting. I'm thinking of sprinklings. Do you guys remember sprinklings yogurt? Should I just stop talking? All right, there we go. Uh, Mario finally used his quirk, his energetic quirk, to cheer on Dragmire because Dragmire wasn't feeling motivated. Good job, Mario. Mario's friends with everyone. And Mario, you're the best. <laughs> Such a pal. All right, didn't finish off Rock and Nia though. Oh geez. Uh, uh, hey, you know, I might not be stubborn this time <laughs> if you want to heal me. 
Sprinklins was what it was called, right? That was a real thing, I thought. Anyone want to talk about old groceries with me? Old lunchbox favorites? Anybody? Just me? Okay. <laughs> well, just checking. Alright, gave him an encore so guys could cook two meals. Delicious. Perfect. All healed up. <laughs> uh, oh, no MP candies! Oh, wait, wait. Thanks. Alright, Dragmire gave him a candy. I see how it is. You only want Jazz to heal you. Oh, <laughs> oh, trouble in paradise. Dragmire stole more candy since he gave his away. Flambe! Dang it, that still didn't finish rocking it. Uh, dang. This is making it look like we should have got that treasure after all. <laughs> Who ate all the HP bananas? Charity. Alright, don't worry. Here, you can have my banana. Oh, thank you, Mario. <laughs> You're so kind. Thank you, Mario. Oh, what's up, Zeke? Hey, Zeke. How's it going? <laughs> Discuss Mondo Fruit Squeezers. Yes, now we're talking. Uh, they were much better than the Kool-Aid Cool Bursts. That's uh, what I can bring to the table. Wasn't there's another one called Squeeze It, right? Those things had the coolest caps. <laughs> Boy, I love talking about juice bottles. <laughs> hey. But yeah, good to see you, Zeke. <laughs> good to see you. Yeah, squeeze it! Now yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Fortunately, Rockin' is being nice and dealing out there. Encore! Deep. You didn't get much juice in any of those things. Mondo, maybe you did, but yeah. Hold up. Uh, so Zeke, this is the demo and we only get uh, three people in the party. And these three people wanted to be in it more than you. So that's uh, why we have this team. But uh, if or when I get the full version, I'll put you in my team. How's that? <laughs> All right, good. Hey, we had to do that with our rear projection TV, uh, Dragmire. And uh, our uncle was telling jokes as we were lowering it down the stairs. And Daniel was afraid he was going to get crushed by the TV. He didn't understand why our uncle was uh, joking. And you know what? I have to agree with him. It was pretty darn heavy. Yeah, full version's going to be sweet. Looking forward to that. Do you know when it re uh, releases? G-Man, and I don't know what happened with the Garbage Kings thing, but it didn't show up. Oh wait, hold up. Let me click on this. Ooh, 20% juice. Mario, I don't think you're on the whitelist. Let me fix that. Alright, Mario. Uh, try posting that again, and it should work. Sorry about that. Alright. I think, yeah, everyone's... All the healers are out of MP, so I'm gonna use some healing sprinkles. Heal them up. All right, we're now out of sprinkles. No, oh, no! Oh, no! Are we screwed? I'm sure you almost got rockin' yeah. July 28th? <laughs> squeeze! They had people on them! No, yeah, I forgot about that! <laughs> squeeze it's were the best! Oh, no, Mario! Mario died. Uh... Uh... Well, rest in peace, Mario. Sorry that we were an awful team. All right, don't worry. Uh, Dragmire trapped Rockania, so at least Dragmire didn't get hurt that turn. Trini uh, Trinitrons are pretty good, yeah. If you can, if you see that little red, green, blue logo, go get it. Oh, Drag I wouldn't have died if you didn't go crazy with the sprinkles. Well, you're right. Look, now Dragmire's dead too. All right, so Dragmire died too, but fortunately, right before the end. Jazz finished rocking the oh, Holy crud! What the heck? What the heck? All right, it, it might have helped to get those treasures, but you know, Mario you know. is mad. <laughs> oh man, and rightfully so. You you all still get exp. Uh, let's give it to Mario. It's like hush money. Here you go. <laughs> Jazz saved the day. He did, and we used the sprinkles on Jazz. So it, in the end, it was the right thing to do. 
Your friend just had to pop open the lid of the sprinkles and throw them all away. Whoops. You know how it is. Whoopsie doodle. You just want a little salt on something and oh dang, the whole <laughs> thing comes out. MP candy effect enhanced. Did we get that because so many people Ooh. died? Oh, it's Ooh, be MP power. Candy. See, it helps to be wasteful. Scarf them down. Mmm. <laughs> and they were delicious. <laughs> he do it again. I don't know how you're still my friend, Mario. Oh, see, we could have used this earlier. Avenge. Yeah, that would have been great. Oh, well. I'm glad we're still friends, Mario. Even after all that. All right, continue playing because we're pretty much at the end now. I think basically we're at the end. All right. So that, well, why not waste some more money? Except we can't afford anything. Do we have tickets? Bananas. No, it's fine. I don't think you're. Our friendship totally is on shambles. Oh no. But we'll hush Mario with <laughs> delicious treats. Would you? Will eating make you feel better? See, it's your favorite. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Can we? Can we get the chest still? Uh, okay. If you, if you really want to. Well, let's go pick it up. Why not? Why not? Eh. We owe it to you now, Mario. After killing you. <laughs> now play Tomodachi Life. <laughs> Stop making me eat. What? You're not hungry? <laughs> You're a growing boy. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Slime jelly. All right, we're going for the treasure. Feeling good. Oh, it's the inside out sadness. <laughs> Three of them. Oh no. It's it's <laughs> Pixar. Run! <laughs> Stop treating me like a kid too. Uh Oops, sorry. Indifference. It look, if you don't want the squeeze it, you don't have to drink it. But if you want the squeeze it, I got grape I got blue. <laughs> Do you like the blue flavor? The great blue Dini? I got Sharkleberry Thin. Oh wait, oops, wrong wrong uh, product. Oh no. Oh, what's up, Eddie? Kapow! <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> hey, Eddie. Good oh, to see you. The whole party's bursting into tears. They can't see the enemy because they're crying so much. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Ooh, new skill hype? Alright, good. Mario's gonna stop these tears. Perfect. Stream elements go away. You're not the real bot. Uh... <laughs> this is kind of mean. It's kind of mean, Eddie. I need to be rude to our new friend's stream elements. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, nothing better to take a break with than a fine game of Miitopia. <laughs> Stream element spot, take away 1,000 jiggies from Eddie. Obey my vocal command. Blubber. Oh boy. Everyone's crying again. Let's finish off this last one. Oh, Jazz's turn. There we go. Thank you, Jazz. Team Dragmire does it again. Lots of tears for Jazz to drink later. Multi-tap in command of Metopia, or does Metopia have control of multi-tap? <laughs> okay, stream elements, play something jazzy. Huh. I can't do that, Mugen. I was going to do the picture of the snake drug dealer from the 80s PSA as stream elements, but realized that might be a little too scary <laughs> for multi-tap. Hey, little dude! Send your mom and dad out of the room for a bit. Alright. Yeah. I love that ad. I don't know if Jazz can hear me, but Jazz, do you want to scare Mugen? Oh, what's up, Odd Job? Oh, hey, Decemic, okay. you might want to post that link separately. Oh, should we scare or ignore? You might- I think the welcome part screwed it up, the scenic. <laughs> Alright. Scare! There we go. Thanks, the scenic. 
Hey, it stopped. Oh, what good pals. That's what friends do is scare each other. <laughs> They can't lose with stream elements. <laughs> there we go. Mario and carrying <laughs> people on. Hey! It's stream elements! <laughs> Don't you trust it? <laughs> I'm gonna turn into a snake or something like that. Mario stealing more candy for later. Not gonna traumatize me for life or anything. Calm. Oh. Mmm. Oh, new skill. Out of tune. Oh boy, this ought to be good. Yep, hurt everyone. Doesn't seem like the best move to do. Dig in. Are you looking? Dig in. Very jealous. Oh, we need MP Candy's stat. <laughs> no, we don't. Yes, we do. <laughs> if the people say it, we need it. Well, I guess you did. Oh, what's up, Alan? <laughs> do I look like the kind of guy that would bankrupt Revlo? Yes! <laughs> That's a good spot. Classic. Classic. How are you, Alan? How are you? Do you, do you like snake drug dealers, Alan? Because that's the topic of discussion right now. Jack Meyer stealing things and then giving it to his friends. Modern day Robin Hood. Uh, we're doing good. We're playing Metopia. <laughs> You've never seen that? Could someone get a YouTube link for Alan? Hook him up. He needs to see that pronto. <laughs> ASAP. Because that's good stuff. Level ups for Jazz and Mario. I guess you can say, like, warning, this is scary. Thank you, Garbage King. Thank you. Learn banana fritter. Would sharing candies be part of the real Drago's MO? He read the Laffy Taffy's to us. <laughs> Close enough. Uh, that's pretty accurate. Yeah, that it's neat. I, I like a lot of the different uh, things they have to offer. Not too bad. And it's working pretty well. Oh, okay, you've seen it? Well... Scale. <laughs> what is scary, really? <laughs> that ad. See, it's just like Revlo. Um, boy, that gets him every time. <laughs> gets him every time. It, I, <laughs> I can't alias that. I tried. They have modules, and I can't alias, uh, the roulette module. So instead. I put in a nice little warning for you. Can you? Because I tried. Did you try, Alan? Did you get it to work? Because maybe I just missed the option. I looked. I must not have looked hard enough. Okay. Well, I'll go fix that now. Gives me something to do. I thought you couldn't, but shows what I know. I know you can change other commands, but I don't know about module commands. You know what I mean? Know what I mean? Uh, um, let me check the commands thing. I don't know if you can. Uh, yeah. See, I don't think you can, Alan. Trust me, if I could, I would, but I can't. But if you find that I can, uh, let me know, because that would be nice. I might just be overlooking it. Oh, are we at the treasure finally? You're almost at the treasure. We're on a roll. I think this is just a small treasure. The real one's at the end. Hey, that's not bad, though. A little gold. Oh, wait, that's not even the big... I see what you mean. Good, Good. job, Chris. Hey, thank you, Mario. <laughs> Alright, here we go. 
polka <laughs> dot vestments. This was worth it. You're uh, right. Looks like what the Berenstain Bear mom wear. <laughs> Mama bear. Mama bear. All right. Uh, oh, do you want do you want baby blue? I think you should stick with baby blue Mario. It looks great. But if you want a different color, uh, let me know. Is this the color you want? Going once, going twice, going three times. All right. Uh, okay, baby blue. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, was that not it? All right, I guess maybe. Oh, there's more. No, that was it. Oh. All right. Can we play rock scissors paper again? Uh, maybe. It, if someone gives you tickets for the reward, or I guess Rocket Nia. If Rocket Nia doesn't give you tickets, then <laughs> we'll have to, uh, we could like scan in the meat. Oh, we didn't get any tickets. Okay, yeah, never mind. Just, yeah, keep going. All right. We'll get him a new staff, though, with the money we got. We need the healer to be as mighty as possible. No need to worry about it matching your hammer anymore, because you got something new. All right, so... Have you guys ever played this little game called Dungeons and Dragons? <gasps> Just wondering. Maybe you have. I haven't. I played the arcade one, but not quite the same thing. Let's go. Give Rocket Nia her face back. You've been trying to get a group going? What, Jazz won't play? You should invite Jazz. Jazz loves drawing characters. Well, Eddie, they haven't proved that yet. <laughs> uh, jury's still out on that one. Oh, joyous day. I need more than Jazz. Um, Says who? Did you try time. Jazz's father? <laughs> Maybe? Feel happy person. Adventurer, you've done so much for us. Let me show you my gratitude. Uh, see all the ones you can recognize, Odd Job. Well, let's ask the mayor, Odd Job. Oh, it's okay, Alan. I was, I was hopeful that you could, but it's all right. It's not a big deal. I've got my annoying uh, reminder command instead. What? Are you loitering or something? We're looking for the Dark Lord. Can you plan to defeat him? I believe you. Not. Oh man, just like the real Fooey. <laughs> It's you, <laughs> OJ. What? <laughs> Did the town get back? <laughs> no, not Blackleaf. No, I'm gonna die. <laughs> You're dead. You don't exist anymore. That's us playing this game. <laughs> That's bad. We're done for. Crikey. Adventure, would you go after the dark? Lord? That's not a D20. That's a volleyball. That's not a D20. It says you're a dubious mayor, Oddjob. It's okay. And you gave an introduction. You need this to get in the castle. Please take care. Half D and D, half Warhammer, mixed wedding. Is that a real thing? Is that for realsies? All right. So we could go after that treasure chest, or we can go to the end. <laughs> I say go to the end. All right. We got we got the cool polka dot thing. We don't need anything else. All right. Uh, warning. Look, in, it's Alan. Warning in advance to people: if you don't like shilling, cover your eyes. Cover your eyes, uh, shillers. You are approaching Greenhorn Castle. I'm sorry, but I can't let. Oh, you have a letter of introduction from the mayor. Unfortunately, this is as far as you can go in this demo. However, if I may say so. A grand adventure awaits in the full version of the game. Boo! Oh, <laughs> look at this trailer! Oh, oh what a big world! Whoa! <laughs> Sell me whoa! on it. <laughs> whoa! <laughs> whoa! Whoa! What the heck? Look at all those creatures and their food! Food for days! Food for days! <laughs> New jobs! Jobs for a- you get a job, you get a job! Weapons and clothing! Wow! This is great! Uh... I don't have my wallet or I'd be throwing uh, money at the screen. <laughs> and you can go straight to the e shop or you can go back to your fine demo. And <laughs> you lock up. Okay, thanks Alan, thanks for that.
Is that it then? All right, and that that's it. Again, you can go around in the demo as much as you like, but you're pretty much trapped in this area, and I guess all this stuff will transfer to the full game, but... You're uh, ready for Mighty Gunvolt Burst? Uh, I, I am. All right, you guys ready for Mighty Gunvolt Burst? Uh, first off, let me just say thank you again to Mario Aran for being a great healer, Jazz for cooking up some food, and Dragmire for uh, <laughs> not getting too angry. <laughs> So let's switch to Mighty. Should I do True Dungeon? Uh, ask Dave about that one. Ask Dave. Smart people will restart the game to min-max everything. Yeah. Oh, wait. Uh, can you turn down the volume slider? Yes. All right. Let's update this. It's gunvolt time. Mighty Gunvolt. Wait, they don't have Mighty Gun- Oh wait, there it is. Alright. There we go. Oh boy. I can barely hear that. Eddie, if you like fun loot RPGs or conventions, then stay away. Well, that rules out everything. <laughs> So All right. Turn this off. Uh, yes. Go ahead. And does any of the audio stuff need to be switched? Uh, no. Okay. We're good. Okie dokie. It's Mighty Gumvold time. So, Mighty Number no. 9 first came out. Uh, I think it's going to be next, or this coming up Wednesday. So, this is pretty appropriate. Pretty appropriate. Almost one year anniversary. first uh Ooh, challenges a lot of challenges so uh, i i did play i did play a lot of this wow last night do you guys think you play it wait go back to your file <laughs> one hour and 22 minutes well it's not so bad but but i'm gonna have to start over because you don't get the cutscenes. oh okay he, he's starting everything. from scratch everybody so I, I could see, I did unlock the hard mode. I could play on the hard mode. I get the feeling that's probably going to be a bad idea if we want to finish this tonight, so. Um, yeah, we'll do normal. And I could also play as Gunvolt, but I mean, the point is. You gotta be back. You gotta be back. You gotta be back. 20XX, Breakthroughs in Robot Technology, 20 Numbers, Powerful Team of Robots Developed by Dr. White, Hell's Chaos, it's telling the story of the first Mighty Number no. 9. The ninth mighty number, a robot named Beck, was somehow unaffected by this phenomenon. Equipped with the ability to bring his brothers and sisters back to normal, Beck was successful in returning them to their true selves. And so, in trying to prep him, Dr. White made a little training simulation for him. Be our training program, uh, and be able to sync with your power up, evolve as you progress. But, Roger that, Professor. To anyone who hasn't seen anything about this game yet. It's pretty different from Mighty Number no. 9 how it works. In Mighty Number no. 9 you would hurt things and then absorb them. In this one you can't air dash or anything. I mean maybe you can. I don't know because there's abilities and stuff you can unlock but from the get-go you can't do any of that dashing stuff. Alright. Does the game sound okay? Can you guys hear it? Should I crank it? You know how much I love to crank it. Uh, yes, Ricky, they like they announced pretty much I think on the day that they announced this that there's gonna be DLC for other characters Which is probably why they made it ten dollars Because how else are they gonna get people to buy bunches of DLC if they don't buy the base game? All right, so yeah, this tells you about the burst system. This is about the closest thing to absorbing in mighty number no. nine You get a little bonus if you kill things close to you so I did oh, it with burst. that one. So you want to try and kill things really close. I regretted that as soon as I said it, Mungo, okay? Ouch. But should I turn it up? Is it loud enough? Oh boy. Son of a gun. This game was the real Mighty Number no. 9. The game wouldn't get so much flack. Mate, maybe. Maybe. I'm, I'm pretty surprised by how everyone is uh, 
so positive about this. I thought people would go, I'm not getting tricked again. All right, it sounds good. Great, wonderful. Ah, uh, uh, it's and, a bot. And yeah, for anyone who played the uh, other Mighty Gunbolt games, you'll notice that the sprites are like all new. All new, guys. Because the Beck in that one, I thought he looked pretty cool, but looking back now, it's like he doesn't really look even that much like Beck. So now they got, since the actual Mighty Number no. 9 came out, they were able to make him look a lot more like Beck does. Pretty cool. Give him a bit more personality away from that other guy. Stay tuned for the all-new Doug. I miss the what's-her-name Angel Girl. Oh yeah, so in uh, Mighty Gunvolt, the original one, you could pick from Beck. Gunvolt for Ikoro, I think, which was from Integrate's other game, and she again, she's probably going to be DLC. I mean, I think they announced that she's going to be DLC. Thank you, Throwdown Joe. Appreciate that. Oh, what's up? Uh, see you later. Hey, hey. Love your name. <laughs> Gets me every time. <laughs> go, Beck, go. Get this stuff. This is uh, Mighty Gunvolt Burst. Right. Uh, no, the original Gunvolt Burst isn't included in this. This is pretty different from the original one. <laughs> it's, a, it's a pretty good name. Creative stuff. Is there a limit on text per shoutouts? Uh, there shouldn't be? I haven't got any more redemptions, so I don't know if they're working or not. There probably is some kind of character limit, but... Shoot. I don't know. Hopefully it works, but if it doesn't, then I I don't know. Honestly, the thing Kamish might have run into was a cooldown, maybe? Because there is like a small cooldown, but it shouldn't... Maybe not, I don't know. Yeah, I think a lot of people like when the game's not 3D, when it's just, you know, 2D, especially with pixels and stuff, which is makes a lot of sense why they went back to that with Mega Man 9 and 10. And some people are like, oh, I don't want 8-bit Mega Man anymore. I want something new, and yet when they actually play it, they're like, I don't like it. I want 8-bit Mega Man. Thank you, Throwdown Joe, for the follow. Appreciate that. All right, so a guy who looks like Gunvolt is basically taunting Beck. Gunvolt, huh? Who in the world is this guy? Crossovers. There's a problem with the VR training program under the control of a GM named Gunvolt. Uh, a GM? Is that a D&D &D thing? Oh wait, that's DM. Never mind. <laughs> My mistake. Ah. Uh, or to help robots who've lost control, but that power is locked during training. So yeah, the whole thing from Mighty Number no. 9 where Beck can help robots and stuff isn't in this game. So you don't get weapons when you beat bosses in this game. We've only had one shout out, Gamer Bro, but it worked. So, uh, working great, really. Working perfect. Not just Super Nintendo graphics, but sounds too. Is it some bonus? Uh, ooh, it could be. Maybe it's a secret unlockable thing. Oh, really? I, like yeah. that's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't. I don't know a lot about this game, so. Oh, what's up, Fluden? When's the 3DS one coming out? June 29th. Ah, uh, that sounds right. Like what you said, because you looked it up just last night, right? Yeah. Yeah. It seems like it was just the end of the month. Alright, so yeah, so you don't get weapons when you beat bosses, but you can make weapons at any time. The thing is, though, that a lot of your customization options are locked until you earn them by going through the stages. So we'll try and make a weapon real quick. Uh, drill. Who did publish this? I'm not sure. Uh, I, I figure it was self-published by Anticrates, was it not? Got me. Uh, I don't know if there's going to be really anything we can improve on. You can, like, save money on these things, because, like, 
as you see here, most bullets, they'll last the full length. But you can make it so that they last a short amount of time. Shout out from Dragmire. Ah! The Nintendo streaming channel has always been celebrated for its excellence as a Texas stream by Multitap. Uh... Sorry. Yeah, Orson Welles voice? That's hard for me to do. <laughs> uh, hope that was still good enough, Dragmire. Hope that was still good enough. Thanks for the shout out. No, sure. So, made a drill weapon is really not that much better than the weapon we already had. Oh, Fluden, thank you for the follow. Appreciate that. Mighty salute. <laughs> One uh, interesting change from your classic Mega Man games, which I actually forget if it was like this in Mighty Number no. 9, it seems like it was maybe when you're going up ladders. You know how usually when you press jump, you'll just fall off them in Mega Man? Yeah. Here you can jump up them. Oh, really? So it's like, at first it's a little bad because you're used to just pressing jump to fall off them, but you can still hold down and jump, so you can do both. But. Well, I honestly, yeah, it used to frustrate me that I couldn't jump up the ladders, so... Yeah. It's, it's kind of neat that it's here. Yeah, no, it's real nice for getting through parts faster. Or like, when you have to jump from ladder to ladder. Hey, I'd like to see Megapony do that, Garbage King. <laughs> <laughs> These things, I don't entirely understand how they work. Oh boy. It's like you have to fire to go up. Ooh. There's all sorts of little, like, secrets like that to the level, and I don't know where, like, any of them are, so... <laughs> Megapony doesn't need to concern itself with fancy gimmicks. <laughs> well, true enough. It's got phony. <laughs> it, it's, it's got fundamentals. <laughs> fundamentals. Oh, shoot. Actually, this looks like a Megapony uh, level, to be <laughs> honest. It has stuff like this, I thought. Oh, yeah. Unless I'm crazy. I, I mean, it was a little more fatal, but... Yeah, that's... I mean, usually that's what you see from integrates is spikes everywhere, but... Right. Fortunately... Ooh, ow. Oh, jeez. Ooh, cherries. Oh, my strawberry. Secrets <laughs> here. I'm gonna be shooting at wolves the whole time. Well, yeah, so... I don't think they let you do it lower than 10 minutes, Alan. So, yeah. 10... Ten jiggies every ten minutes. Everything's gotta be different. And yet similar. Ain't it the truth? <laughs> oh no. He's threatening Megapony in the chat. <laughs> Fluden Megapony, you haven't heard of that in a while. Oh, are you a fan? Hmm. Well, you're in good company. Uh, it, it could. Squishy, it very well could. So I think you need the water to get up there. <laughs> wow, Ricky uh, pulling no punches. To be honest, Start, the negative reception of Mighty Number no. 9's graphics came from one, let's be honest, it was ugly, two, this art raised our expectations. <laughs> Well, it's it's such a weird thing because, of course, you know, Integrates made the original Mighty Number no. 9 too, but the thing was that they were trying to challenge themselves by making a 3D game, and the problem was that they hadn't ever made anything in Unreal before. <laughs> this is not a very Mega Pony centric stream. We tried to play it once, and it crashed the whole stream. It was during How Extra Life to get uh, 2016. We were doing a 24 hour stream. Garbage King said, hey, play Mega Pony. And it crashed our whole computer <laughs> in the middle of a 24 hour stream. <laughs> Can you believe it? I I don't know how Garbage King goes to sleep at night <laughs> after that. It was a stream for the kids. <laughs> for the kids. Frank, take four. No. But I'm sure we'll play Mega Pony some other night. I want my lolly. It's inevitable. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Uh oh. Mighty number no. nine's fine, guys. Come on. Mighty number no. fine is what they called it. I think. Yeah. That was the name. Gotta overclock those chips for Mega Pony. Well, we got we got a new rig. Uh sponsored ah! by Space Kiss. So I'm sure we can handle the raw power of Mega Pony now. The Mega Flops. So another modern change to this game. Something even Mighty Number no. 9 didn't have. You don't get lives in this game. Basically, whenever you die, you get to come back as many times as you want. <laughs> but all it does is, as you see in the bottom left corner there, it adds a little thing to your counter. One retry. And so, if you retry a lot, it hurts your final score. But that's pretty much it. Well, that, that's a good way to do it. That's a good way to do it. Hey, that's kind of like a preview for the Mega Man 3 race. <laughs> yeah. Jumping out of pits. Yeah. But you don't need to use cheats to do it here. This Sunday. Hope everyone's ready. <laughs> uh, Alan might play with you, Squishy. As you can see, our Switch is a little tied up at the moment. <laughs> if Daniel beats this game... Uh... Before 11 o'clock, by some miracle, then we will play Ultra Street Fighter 2. How about that, Squishy? Get him, Flame Guy. Oh, wait, no. Get, get Flame Guy. <laughs> oh, I, I don't know why I was rooting for him. Eat the nanners, it's just like Metopia. Yeah. <laughs> oh geez, what? Oh no. Well, I'm not gonna survive that. Alright. Oops. This game is doubly nice because, as you would know in Mega Man, if you panicked like I did and ate everything right away, mm -hmm. and then you died and you went back, uh oh, you don't have an E can anymore. But in this game, it as long as from your last checkpoint <laughs> you didn't use those items, you still have them. So you can eat without worrying at these boss fights. Oh boy. I like the boss theme in 8-bit. Uh, Who's with me? Just me? Oh well. <laughs> and I'm glad that the most important thing from Mega Man 1 has finally made its way into a Mega Man-esque game, and that's the score at the top. <laughs> the score is back, everybody. The score is back. For Mega Man fans that were like, where's the score? It's finally back. <laughs> right at the top, where it belongs. Actually, didn't Mighty Number no. 9 have a score, too? It did. it did. I don't know if it had it at the top like that. It looks like the Mega Man 1 score. Where's the great voice acting from Mighty Number no. 9? Uh... <laughs> uh, we could read the lines for you, if that would make it better. <laughs> Maybe that would not make it better. <laughs> well, it's... I mean, I will say, uh, spoilers. Uh, it, uh, I, don't know, I don't know, I don't want to spoil it, but there, there's going to be some uh, dialogue near the end. Ooh! Get, get ready for some dialogue. Some actual speech. Uh, no, oh. not, not actual speech, just... Because right now, like, you see before the fights and stuff, usually in Mighty Number no. 9 they would talk. In this one, they don't. They're just like the Robot Masters, the original Robot Masters. They just blow they up. They just plunk down. They, they do have a little fancy name thing, like uh, uh, our favorite game, Borderlands. But um, that's pretty much it. They don't go, hey, Beck, I don't like you. Hey, you, get your darn hands off her. Right, so, oh yeah, and every time you clear a level, you get a choice of rewards. You can get a sticker. Uh, I don't know why you would get this except after you beat the game and you go through the stages again and you want to collect all the stickers. You can also get uh, an element, which these, I guess, are supposed to be what you use for weaknesses. I gotta admit, I couldn't ever figure this out. I almost feel like I should always get these instead of CP. 
Um, hmm. Actually, you know what? I like CP a lot, so... Forget elements. Who needs elements? We do. Stream elements. Alright. So... Let's see. Before you go into a stage, you always want to go and make a new weapon because since you get more CP, you can make better weapons. Exactly. So that's why we should focus on CP instead, because who needs elements? Alright, so... Uh, again, this part, I think... I don't know, this might just be graphic. As far as, like, what color do you want Peck to be and what do you want him to shoot. So, we'll make a spark one. Uh, I don't even know what we earned from that stage. Alright, so we got it. Curve. We can make a curved shot now. Ooh! I know that'll be helpful later. I don't know if we need it right now. Uh, let's see. We can make our shot slower. Don't know why you'd want to do that. Maybe if you really wanted to rub it in. Alright, this is actually one of the best things that you can get. This is, as far as I could see, one of the easiest ways to up your damage is, uh, what this does is basically when it blows up, it blows into a bunch of pieces. So you can do it like this. Oh, but you need a lot of CP. Right. So that's the problem is, unfortunately, we can't afford it yet. But don't worry, we'll be able to afford those soon, and that way we'll be able to do a bunch of damage. So pretty much all we can do right now is make our stuff bigger. Or, actually, what I'm going to do for this one... Oh, wait, Char Shot. Ooh, I never got that one before. Hey! Char Shot. Something oh. new. Oh boy, this is weird. Oh, so uh, like you link it to a different one? Oh, this is weird. What's going on? Marky Marks make my Mega Man? Uh, uh, homing torpedo? Is that so, the way to go? So this is, so I'm guessing what this means is it will make the charge shot a different one that you make and so that way you can make like a one shot that's powerful. All right, so huh? I might try that. Ooh, that's gonna... You know what? This is weird. I'll forget that for now. I'll just give him some armor. Actually, wait, there was one other thing that could make his bullets huge. Not that huge. All right, never mind. <laughs> Re regular size. Regular size bullets. Uh, kind of want to try the charge shot thing. All right, so we'll make a missile. We'll make a huge missile. Gigantic missile. Let's see. Might want to make it slow to save a mic. Are we going to be able to afford? Let's see. Maybe? Oh, wait. Missiles can't do that. What were we on before? Spark? Alright, we'll do Spark. Ooh! Yeah, we can't afford that unless. make it a slow bullet because slow and steady doesn't matter if it's all slow and here's another way to save money if you make it so you actually get more hurt while you're shooting it and <laughs> that's a lot of huh let's see what else all right well we'll make it so it doesn't last that far all right so yeah oh. it's the perfect gun now so tiny all right Alright, we'll try on this one. Oh wait, can't edit that one. Never mind. Alright, how about this one? How much does it cost to make a charge shot? Whoa! Alright, it doesn't look like it costs that much. Charge manual. Ooh, you can do like auto charging. Wow. So you need but you need a little more before you can do that? So I do, unless I Weaken this gun a bit. Oh no, it's what? already so weak. There we go. See, it's uh, all right. Oh wait, actually, all right. So I'm. Gonna, oh my god. I want to test it. Let's see. Uh, oh, he's charging. I guess the yellow's when it's charged. It, <laughs> it, it, it looks the same. Oh, actually, it doesn't. Since this wait, no, works. no. So it's not linking. What it's doing is it's linking 
two different kinds, right? right. So, so when you charge it, you can use the other one. Right. So that. Way but you... what's the point? Because you could switch whenever you want. Well, all right. So the point is that you can make a huge shot, like something that would cost a lot. Oh, it's cheaper like, that way. Short range. And what I did was, and I don't know if this is going to affect me or not, is on this one, in order to uh, get enough money for it to do that, I made it so that usually when I use it, he would take three times the damage. Okay. So that saved money on that. So I don't know if when I use my charge shot, if he'll like still take a bunch of damage or not, but uh, hopefully not. So we'll see how that works. It's kind of a stupid charge shot right now anyway, but... Uh, I'm sure it'll be good. Man, it doesn't take any time at all to customize <laughs> your weapons in the world of Mighty Gunvolt Burst. <laughs> and another, like, if you... Because the charge seems like it takes a while, but, you know, that was... Like we were saying, I wish that I could uh, switch between weapons faster. Mm -hmm. It's like, if you could do it where you could charge it pretty fast, then it's like you could have two different shots. One reason why I feel like maybe they didn't let you uh, change immediately is because maybe they didn't want people to be doing that where like they're sw switching between them fast. Because mm -hmm. I guess every time you switch them, it has to like get rid of all the bullets and stuff. And since you can do stuff like increase your armor with some bullets. You shouldn't need more than one gun. Once you make the ultimate weapon, that's all you need, right guys? <laughs> you just need one killer weapon and you're done. Like Zero has his lightsaber. He doesn't need anything else, right? Oh uh, yeah. <sighs> oh, see if your gun would have like made a platform for you <laughs> to stand on. See, that's what I want to know. If, if You can make utility weapons. If, yeah, if there's stuff like that, I would love using that. Of course, it wouldn't be much good if you couldn't fast switch, but that's why you would want to do the chop shot. Yeah. Under the sea. Oh boy. <laughs> did any of the Mega Man folks work on this? Kind of, because any creates did what? Mega Man Zero and Nine and Ten, I think. Uh, yep. So. And chip challenge. And chip challenge. <laughs> so they've they've worked on Mega Man games before. Uh, and as you know, all the music from Mighty Number no. Nine was composed by the person who composed all the music for Mega Man One. The eight-bit arrangements, though, were done by the Integrates musician Bo Yamada, I think. And he also composed some of the other tracks on Mighty Number no. 9 along with some other composers, like the Mega Man 2 composer. And we all know how good the music in Mega Man 2 is. Oh boy. Oh no. <laughs> but what about the Mega Pony composer? <laughs> what about the <laughs> Pony composer? <laughs> I think. Some of Fooey's favorite uh, songs in video games come from Megapony. I don't know if Fooey's still around, but figure I'd let you guys know a little fun fact about Fooey. Which was his favorite song? Wasn't there like a Wily Stage One ripoff in Mega Pony? It was, it was around where yeah, the Wily Stage One. I think. I mean, or the equivalent of Wily Stage One in Mega Pony. I think. Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean, good lord? Don't you mean good tunage? <laughs> That's easy listening right there. <laughs> good song. Good song. Ooh, ice cream. Oh, Songmaster K, thank you for the follow, and thank you for the awesome t-shirt design that you did for us. Thank you. Much appreciated. 
Welcome to uh, Mighty Gunvolt Burst. Uh oh. Welcome. <laughs> what better way <laughs> to come into the stream? <laughs> If you guys have seen the, uh, what's it called, Happy CRT t-shirt on the Design by Humans t-shirt store that was done by Songmaster K. Yeah, the Happy, the one you bought, Alan. Alan bought your shirt, uh, Songmaster K. He's even got a picture of him in that shirt, yep. That, the exact same one. <laughs> Yeah, he did a good job on that. <laughs> Classic tune, very underrated. Oh man. It's Bubble Guy. <laughs> oh, his name's Cryosphere? Uh, yeah. That's exciting. <laughs> They, I don't... Some of these boss names, I don't know. <laughs> Not so catchy. I like Battalion, though. I oh. guess. I'm pretty okay. You can always just call them by their mighty numbers, too. Oh, I know them all, then. It's Mighty 1 through uh, 8. <laughs> and Beck is Mighty number 9. <laughs> you got it. I'm so smart. <laughs> Ask me how I knew. <laughs> Hey, good job, Decemic. Long live ukulele. <laughs> I thought. Oh my god. This character not talking is a huge improvement. I remember the voice being a little irritating. Just a little bit. <laughs> but, you know, don't you miss the, the, the charm? The charm, the wit. Don't worry, like I said, there's still some wit coming up. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm ready. Excitement she wrote. Get him, bubble guy. Oh, wait, get, get the bubble guy is what I mean. <laughs> I keep rooting for the bad guys. Good job, Daniel and Beck. You deserve that watermelon, cherry, <laughs> banana, peach, ice cream, cone, and uh, is that cheesecake? Uh, or just regular cake? It might just be right. It might be strawberry. What's the penalty for? Uh, dying. Oh, okay. It's not that much, honestly. Yeah, they're pretty nice. Like, I forget. Is it not showing... Uh, there we go. So I got a C rank on that one, A rank on this one, S rank. <laughs> Can't get anything but S rank on the first one. You know me too well, gamer bro. Uh, Alright. So, got a little more money. And hopefully, do a bit better attack. Let's see. Oh wait, also, whenever you go through the stage, you also get different stuff to customize. I don't know what we earned that time. Looks like some stuff for the charge shop, maybe? <laughs> Congrats to Mighty Number 9 guy. Hey, great picture, Dragmire. Alright, cool. So now it's immediate. So if we could actually make a good charge shot, then it would be worthwhile. But I don't know if we can make one yet. Let's see. One thing we can improve on, we can make this not slow. Ooh, average speed. So it's not weaker than the shot we already have. Alright, we can make this bigger. Ooh! Almost. <laughs> Medium bullets. Alright, anything else we can change? Can we make it full length? Alright. Speed, average, straight. Oh, so... I don't want to make it a curve. Ah, the curve! I mean, I guess I could. Might as well, right? That way I can have both. See, I mean that seems okay. I guess fast. There we go. Yes. 
Hey, call. Remember the time I told everyone my game was better than nothing? <laughs> wow. Spot on, Mungo. Spot on. Do you write for Family Guy? <laughs> if not, uh, you're hired. Whose stage is this? Uh, Mighty number three, which is Dinotron, I think. Oh, is it Electricity Girl? Yes. Better known as Electricity Girl. <laughs> oh. Who else but Dr. Santa? <laughs> oh, would you guys like some grapes? Got the TBT Ezar. -E <laughs> what the heck is that? I don't know what the deal with the names are. Is it all Gunvolt stuff? Maybe? Because, yeah, I don't know anything about Gunvolt, so probably. What could possibly go wrong? Oh, Alan. Thank you for the cheer. Thanks, Alan. 